Alright, uh, back to the story. Uh, after I came back from Australia, I ended up driving straight back up north and uh, straight to Horike. Yeah, Horike. And um, my father got me a tuhonga. A pretty revered tuhonga from up north. And uh, what he made me do was uh, two o'clock in the morning. I had to jump in the Hokianga Harbour uh, from Horike and uh, rinse my mouth out and you know spit it out. And I was supposed to be a uh, able to send this whatever it was back to Australia through the harbour and I did all that uh, came out dried off went back home he says oh we have to send it back before the sun came up and then went back home uh, he poured me a jug of water he said skull this I'll put it in a glass he said skull that back and you have a dream like no other and this dream is only for you and I was like, whoo, alright so I went to sleep had an awesome dream uh, it's a bit surreal but it takes a while to puzzle it together even though this was 20 years ago 20 years ago um, yeah um, the dream I was, I could see uh, Jackie Chan with a CD on his finger, upside down, so that was my dream, and uh, uh, for me trying to interpret it, uh, was either music was my kung fu, <laughs> or music was my art, or music on the CD was my art, or music is as powerful as kung fu something like that anyway but yeah take it as it is but uh yeah sometimes a tuhonga can help uh within your journey and uh hopefully you you may experience it but yeah it does help and i'll leave you with that thought and i'll continue my story later cheers bye